Greetings everybody, welcome to Francis M channel. Today, the movie I'm going to describe for you guys is Bloodshot. So let's get it started. After leading a successful rescue operation of hostages in Mombasa, US Marine Ray Garrison and his wife Gina travel for a holiday at an Italian beachside town in the Amalfi coast. They are kidnapped by a group of mercenaries led by Martin X who demands to know how the US military learned about the hostages and their location. When Ray explained that he cannot answer as he is not privy to this information, Ax executes Gina in front of him. Ray vows revenge and X kills Ray as well. An amnesic Ray awakens in the laps of rising spirit teach OST, a company in Kuala Lumpur specializing in cybernetic enhancement for disabled US military personnel CEO and lead science Dr. Emil Harting tells Ray he is the first successful UN subject of the bloodshot program, resecurating and healing him through the injection of experimental nanotech nanotechnology now replacing his entire bloodstream. This technology increases his strength and heals his injuries. But the, nan the nanites need to be actually replaced and recharged or he will eventually succumb to damage and die again. When the nanites work at the extremely power, they create a red glowing circle of the light on Ray chest. Ray is introduced to Dr. Harding and other patients, including former U.S. Navy Diva Kelly, with whom he strikes up a friendship. Former service member Marcus Tip and ex Navy SEAL Jimmy Dalton, who overly dislike Garrison after experience flashback of Gina and X, he lives to avenge Gina's death. Using the nanites and OST servers to hack into database, Ray tracked down X to Batapes and kill him along with his bodyguards. Back at OST, Ray is put to sleep as his nanites are rebooted, as he has done many times before. Harting then replaces Gay's memories with a new scenario of how Gina died, this time with X associate Nick Barry's as the culprit. Katie objects to Hatting repeatedly, manipulating Ray's memory so he will go after different targets without question or remorse. But she is ignored and reminded that OST can kill her by deactivating her enhancements. Ray awakens once again, Amizek, and is reintroduced to OST. Then experience flashback of Barry's kidnapping and killing him and Gina. Driven by revenge, her track Barry's to East Sussex and kills him, despite the man pleading that OST is lying. While Fred Wigan, a programmer forced to work for Barry's, activates an EMP bomb that incapacitate Ray and Surf is linked with OST. Ray awakens in Vegan's office and experiences contradicting memories of who killed Gina. Vegan helped him realize OST has been manipulating him so he could kill the company's enemies and rivals. Ray tricked down Gina, learning she is still alive but that their relationship ended five years ago and since then she has started a family in London. Harting Sends Katie after vegans after asking vegan for help in freeze in freeing him herself from OST control and taking down the corporation. She tells Harting she failed to capture the programmer. Meanwhile, Ray is recaptured by Dalton and tipped and brought back to the laboratory. Katie and vegans sabotage sabotage the reprogramming process and destroy the OST computers. Ray awakes and Dalton and Tip try to 
subdued him. After a lengthy battle, he kills them as the OST building is destroyed. Harting confronts Ray, confident that the Marine will surrender now that his nanites have been exhausted. To his surprise, Ray is willing to die to achieve victory and activates an explosive, destroying them both. Ray laid awake with his full memories, revived by Vegan, who has updated his technology so his nanites are self sufficient. The two men and KT then live in search of a new life. The end. So that's it for this movie description for the movie of Bloodshot. And I hope you guys enjoy this movie, this video. So see you guys in the next video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you will not miss the next video. Goodbye, good luck, and take care.